A St. Louis Area Fire Department is forced to limit how far their ambulances will transport patients. And this all comes after the department and many others in the area get more and more emergency calls. Fox 2's Amelia McGavro is live now in North County with more on why these changes are being made now. Amelia. Yeah, Mandy Vick, the Florissant and Valley Fire District decided this yesterday that they would need to only transport patients to their three closest hospitals. And the department tells me this is a very hard decision to make when they actually made back in 2020, but they say it's necessary to keep resources close to the residents. Florissant Valley Fire Department is facing what many departments are. More calls and limited resources. Physically and mentally, it can drain on the crews, and that's probably the biggest thing that we're seeing. Chief Medical Officer Mark Flotter says the department made the choice Sunday to only transport patients to the three closest hospitals Christian Hospital, Northwest Healthcare, and DePaul Hospital. He says the new restrictions come after seeing their highest number of COVID patients yet. We're almost three times as many patients in. Um, 2022 as in 2021. So if we're transporting to a more distant hospital, that's an extended amount of time that that resource is not available for our residents. Flotter says distance isn't the only thing limiting their resources. He says each time a team transports a COVID patient, that team has to clean the entire ambulance. We write down almost every surface area that can be contacted by the patient or ourselves. We run, run our UVC light. Uh, we run that for approximately 15 to 20 minutes. Um, it's a light that can kill any airborne pathogens such as COVID. The whole process could take more than half an hour and can increase ambulance wait times. Flotter says about 92% of patients already go to those three area hospitals and the restrictions are only temporary. But it's something that we'll reevaluate on a weekly basis and as those numbers start to decrease, we will obviously go back to transporting to those more distant hospitals when we're able. Now, there are exceptions to this. The department says they will still transport patients to other outside area hospitals if the patient is a pediatric patient, a cancer patient, or in need of other specialty care. In Florissant, Amelia McGalvro, Fox 2 News.